Hi guys, so it's been a while, I'm filming the autumn haul today. Um, it's a case of like loads of my autumn clothes that I've been wearing for years and it got tatty. I bought a few new things over the years and stuff was like not fitting anymore. So I did a wardrobe revival, so I've got a lot of items. So grab a hot chocolate or a cup of tea as it is that season. And like it's raining right now, you probably hear it because this room is mostly glass. Um, so yeah, I got a few new cute things, like a lot of things to be honest. This is a huge haul. Me and Joe are going to Japan next week, so I wanted a few cute things as well for our trip. It's really sad to hear about the typhoon and I really hope like the damage isn't too bad and there's like, I know there's fatality, I hope like there's no more and not too many people were injured. It's kind of scary, um, but yeah, I hope everything will be okay. So I'm gonna get right into the haul now and I hope you guys enjoy it. So first of all, whoop, bump the plant, sorry plant. So first of all, I'm gonna start with these trousers that I'm wearing now. Um, they're from Monkey, they're super cool. I have wide leg trace trousers on my favorite. I'm rarely like a skinny trousers kind of gal. Um, they've got this tie waist here. I love this color, it's so autumnal, like a rusty color. They're quite thick and heavy. So um, yeah, they're so cute. I'll be taking these with me to Japan and I love the fit. Um, yeah, I've already worn the trousers. I really love them. So next up is a basic. It is this, um, just like a long sleeve white tee from Monkey. I got it in a medium and I'll just put that on for you guys right now. This t-shirt is actually from Monkey as well, but I got it like in the summer or something. <laughs> okay, so sorry, there's probably like a lot of noises going on in the house as family are doing things. So this is the, it's just a long sleeve full polo t-shirt. I wear it for like a black bra, it's quite thin, but I thought it would look cute underneath things, like layering things. I could hear the washing machine going, I could just hear like all the noises. Um, yeah, so I've just got it tucked into the trousers at the moment. And yeah, it's just a basic. You can't go wrong with like some necessary basics. Okay, um, next up from Monkey is this skirt. It's like a button down skirt. I love the color again. Like, I don't know, it's very autumn -y. It's called Sugar Brown and it's actually a line. I have an issue with like stuff clanging onto my butt, but this doesn't do that. It's really short, but then I know I'm gonna wear it with tights, so it's fine. So I'm gonna show you guys this cute one on. Okay, so this is the skirt. It's really cute. It's got a belt loop as well. Um, it's just like a button down, it's like this denim material and yeah, it's really cute. I think I'm gonna wear this tomorrow probably. <laughs> um, I love it so much. Um, I just needed more skirts and yeah, cause some of my like, skirts for this weather were like not looking so great anymore and I love the color, it's so autumnal and I love the fit as well. But yeah, as I said, it is quite short, but it doesn't cling to my butt, which is a massive bonus for me. And it just feels really nice and soft. Okay, so next for Monkey is this top. It is stripey. It's kind of just a stripey, um, baggy, um, loose, long sleeve top. This was only like £10. I just thought it'd be great again for layering and it's going to go with so many of my clothes and it's really soft. I'm actually thinking about getting it another colour because I also have it like in a yellow stripe. So I'll show you guys this one. Um, yeah, it's just really nice and soft and it's so cosy. Okay, so tucked out, it looks a little bit silly. Like my friend always had kind of like a pyjama top, but then tucked into a skirt or something. It looks really cute. I wouldn't necessarily wear it with this skirt, but yeah. It looks really cute tucked into things. Um, I think it will be better when I show you the next skirt in a minute because I think it looks really, really cute with that. But yeah, this is this top. It's just like a kind of basic, stripy, long sleeve top. Okay, so next up I have this black denim skirt. It's got two pockets on the side and a belt loop from Monkey. All this stuff is from Monkey and kind of going to go in store order. So when I, the store changes, I'll just say. So um, yeah, this is actually a really, again, like a really soft denim and feels really nice. So I'll show you guys on. It's just kind of basic black skirt. Like I needed like a denim black skirt so I didn't have one. That like it actually might be a cotton skirt, but as you can see, this top looks really cute with this black skirt giving me huge like soft grunge vibes which is kind of my thing when it comes to autumn winter. I feel like when it's autumn winter I get kind of more grungy. 
more witchy. I don't know what that's about, but yeah. And then when it's summer, it's just like soft girl and it's like more cutesy. But as soon as it gets colder, I think it's literally more dark and more grungy or like witchy or like also a lot more tartan and sometimes a bit more vintagey. So I, I don't know. Like, I like what I like, but I'm gonna show you the skirt properly. This is the black skirt. I actually think it might be like a cotton skirt. I don't actually think it is denim now. I can't remember. Yeah, so this is the black skirt. It's just like a black skirt and fits pretty nicely and go with a lot of things. I like this as an outfit. Like, I'd wear this as an outfit. I might wear this today, actually. It's like my best friend's birthday. This is very cute. Uh, yeah. I like it, it's a nice cotton, I like the shape, I like the length and everything and I like the fact that it has um, belt loops as well and it's cute topped into this top, it's kind of like a soft grungy vibe look so I'm really happy with this skirt. Okay next from Monkey is this dress, um, this dress gave me cute Japan vibes, I've got a dress that kind of does it, it ties up on the shoulders that's made of a jersey material but this is, it's just the whole the layering thing, the loose fitted thing. I found it really really cute. I got it in a small because the medium was just a huge massive box on me, it wasn't doing anything for me, whilst this um, is super cute and I'm going to show you it lay on top of this top because I bought them together because I thought they looked really really cute. It's this kind of dress, I think they have it in another colour as well. Um, I think this just came in like a few days ago as well but yeah this is super cute. I think this is my favourite item from the monkey haul. Um, yeah, I think I've got a couple more monkey autumns items, autumns? <laughs> a couple more monkey items and I'm moving on to H&M, which there's, I think is my favorite item in the H&M haul, so I can't wait to show you guys. Okay, so this is the dress. I don't think it's doing it justice on, but I've laid it with this underneath. Hopefully you guys can see all the ruffles. It comes to about my knee. It's so cute. I love how loose and flowy it is. Um, Depending on how you want it to fit, I would size down. It ties up here at the shoulders. I feel like I've got the ties a little bit too high, so I'm gonna loosen those. Okay, so I've loosened the ties a little bit so you can see more of the top. It looks so messy. But yeah, I really love the fit of it. Um, it's a really cute and yeah, it's just loose and flowing. The weather in Japan at the moment is kind of weird. It's still like 23 degrees, even though it's October. In England, it's like 15 degrees. So yeah, um, I think this would be really cute. And if I get cold, I can put tights underneath. Um, yeah, I love the silhouette of this dress. I don't think it's doing much justice on the camera, but I'll be taking a lot of photos. So yeah, I think this looks cute with this top. Um, I think black and pink just look great together and yeah, you'll probably see this outfit picture on my Instagram soon. <laughs> okay, I know this isn't very all to me, but it sort of is because it's Czech, but it's a t-shirt. But you know, some days you might want to put a cardigan on top or it's not that cold, like at the moment. So this is this Czech green top. Um, Monkey, I think it was about six pounds and I've paired it with these green trousers I got recently from Monkey as well. I do them in a darker shade of green, like a more khaki shade of green, which I didn't know, but I am loving the shade of green at the moment because green is my favorite color. And um, I also do it in another color. So I'll show you these trousers. This is like the most fitted I like trousers to be. So I'll show you. Okay, so this is the top properly. I've just tucked it in to these trousers. It's sort of a crop top, it doesn't properly tuck into them. Um, and these trousers are great. Sorry, they're not ironed because they have like a stretchy waist here and these are the pockets and I'll show you them properly. Okay, so yeah, these are the trousers. They are so comfy. Definitely look better when ironed. I feel like they got shorter. Interesting. Sure, I think. Yeah. Okay. So yeah, they are really cute. They come to my ankle. Sorry, I'm just looking because like since I washed them, I feel like the legs are a bit shorter. But maybe I rolled them up because I was wearing them with Doc Martens. But yeah, they're so cute and comfy. I love that they're stretchy at the back here, and yeah, they basically fit me perfectly. So yeah, that's that from Monkey. Okay, so. Now I'm moving on to H&M and I'm going to start with my favourite item first. Um, oh yeah, also this black t-shirt is from H&M, I got a black and white one. Um, it's just a basic black tee. But this is my favourite item from H&M, it's this beautiful um, 
check skirt so it's beautiful tartan skirt it's long i have not worn this yet and it has like a belt um yeah i really love it and um, this is so lovely i love the colors it's so pretty and um it's very autumnal so i can't wait to show you guys this on so i've just got this black t-shirt tucked into it which is kind of just like a stretchy black tee from the basics range which is about like three pounds or something like that i needed the black and white tee i've worn this like so many times in the past week or something so and this skirt is beautiful trying to get a thumbnail here let me show it to you guys properly is the skirt i love this um belt detail here it's so cute i love how it's got like the eyelets here it kind of like grunges it up a little bit um i love the way it flows with the pleats excuse me we've just got like thermal socks on at the moment because i'm trying to break in some shoes and yeah I love the length, it's so cute. I'd wear this with like some chunky trainers or something, or like my bands. Let me have a look for a minute. These are new as well, by the way. So these are part of the haul. I got some bands, old school, but I've never had this issue before, but I've had to actually kind of break these in because they're making my feet swell. I don't understand why. I don't actually have this issue with bands before. So yeah, these are new trainers, part of the haul. I've worn them a couple of times and I'm trying to break them in with these thermal socks I think they look this looks really cute with the bands definitely you can feel already like it's rubbing here on my ankle which is the issue can't bother to do it properly so yeah this is cute this is a cute outfit oh I wear them with my other new trainers which you guys will see later which are amazing but yeah, I love this skirt. This is my favourite item. I'm giving this skirt a lot of screen time. Okay, so next from H&M is this corduroy skirt, which is again kind of autumn wintery. I love the colour. It's like a rusty red. It's got pockets beside. This is very similar to the black monkey skirt that I got. Um, even the button, like the t even the button is tortoise shell as well. And the way the pockets are, it's the exact same shape as that skirt actually. The um, only difference is this is made from a soft corduroy and it's rusty red and that's black but apart from that it's pretty much the same skirt if it ain't broke don't fix it i know that fits well so i got this so yeah this is a really cute skirt it goes with this black t-shirt it goes with everything i love the fit um same as the other one it feels really nice and soft and yeah it's just really cute and i could wear it with loads of autumn winter like jumpers cardigans tops um and that's all Okay, this is a white tee from h and it's a basic white t-shirt, um, I want to show you guys this skirt, it's kind of like, it's not really a skate skirt, it's kind of like a bellish skate skirt, I don't know, it's really short but it goes with everything, a skate skirt is my favourite kind of skirt, normally I like it a little bit more out with more pleats but this is a cute basic and I wear it to work because it goes with everything, I can just tuck a checkered shirt into it or put a jumper on top and I'm good to go. Okay, so this is beautiful so at the moment H&M have a Pringle of Scotland collab on and which means lots of agro print jumpers um so I got this beautiful brown and white beige and brownie kind of jumper it's really cute it was really hard to choose one They're only 20 pounds on the Pringle of Scotland website so jumpers are like 300 to 700 like ridiculous money I have an agro print jumper already that I thrifted but it's all primary colours like it's black with and all these bits are like um like the patterns like orange and purple and and then the background's black and it's uh, getting a bit tatty now like I have to shave it a lot with the de bobola like the bobble off thing um whilst I wanted like a new one that's neutral that would go with loads more than that one that's all like primary colours so I thought I would stick to this colour because they've got ones that are, like grey with yellows um, I, I'm like darker but I thought I'd get this one because I know it's going to go with a lot so I'm trying to kind of be like smarter with the things that I buy so I'm going to show you guys this on because it's so cosy and for £20 like it's a really affordable collaboration like if you can't afford Pringle of Scotland I know I can't then um, getting it from h and is a really good option oh, oh. <laughs> just hit my hand on the 
okay this is so cute and warm it's so cozy i got this in a medium let me show you guys properly okay so this is so cozy and warm oh my god i really like it you could wear it like this on top of the skirt but i would probably tuck it in to the skirt you probably want to thick, pick a thicker skirt though because this one's like you can see everything that's tucked into it so probably like my corduroy skirt and that would be really cute so yeah this is so cute this is literally an outfit i would wear this autumn winter i probably will wear this tucked into one of the many skirts that i've gotten uh the jumper is just really lovely it feels so nice it's so warm as well it's a really nice knit um it's like a full polo neck as well so it's not like too choky i'm kind of really fussy with polo necks i really like this length and yeah i really love it they've got loads of different things they've got skirts and top jumpers and um dresses hats gloves accessories so if you're into agro print and pringle scotland um the h&m collab is a good way to go okay so i'm expressing my love for wide leg trousers more now so done with everything h&m moving on to a couple of items i picked up from uniqlo including these corduroy wide leg trousers i'm a bit bitter that it's still 23 degrees in japan i thought it was going to be a bit colder um, but it's fine, I can wear these here. I could probably still wear them there, but I might be hot, but um, we'll see. I got this, them in a lovely pink colour. Okay, so these are the trousers. They are wide leg, similar to the other ones. When I put them together like this, it kind of looks like I'm wearing a skirt of a slit. But they are ultra wide leg. They're really comfy. They're really high waist. waist. I think the 29 had a huge gap here. That's why I didn't get them, whilst this still has a little bit of room. And um, they are so soft. Even softer than that skirt from H&M. I'm just like... Ooh, um, I love the colour. I thought just because it's autumn winter doesn't mean everything has to be like orange and black and red and ooh. So it's like it's cute to have like some pink and pink and black again is a cute combo. So yeah, I would probably just wear these trousers with this t-shirt like this. Um, I might take them with me, I might not. I'm gonna keep keeping an eye on the weather till next week, till we go and see what I end up packing or not. But yeah, these are these trousers, super comfy and fitted, and I got a belt loop as well, so you can like cinch in more. Okay, so I got more corduroy from H&M. What size did I get? I mean, more corduroy from Uniqlo. What size did I get this in? I don't remember. Oh, well. Wow. Okay, I got this in a 28 inch waist as well. So, Let's button this up. It's really cute. It's just a long brown skirt. Yeah, it's not as soft as the pink trousers. I don't know why. I don't know how they're different, but yeah, it's just a long brown skirt, which I thought would look cute with trainers or my Dr. Martins. But, um, yeah, well, I see how I style this because the shape's kind of different to what skirt I would normally wear. Like, normally it'd be like flowy or a bit, I don't know, straight flowy. I don't know. But so it's a little bit, it's like stiff. So, yeah, we'll see how I style this. But yeah, I got this cute corduroy skirt from Uniqlo. Okay, now I'm going to go with these dungarees from Lucy and Yak. They're actually dungaree shorts, and they're like, ah, it's autumn, but tights, tights and shorts are cute. So these look really cute with some thick tights underneath and Doc Martens. So right now I'm going to just put them top of this black t-shirt. I think I've got a picture of me on Instagram wearing them like that anyway. So yeah. These, I love Lucy and Yak. Like all their stuff is so comfy. I've got a couple of pairs of dungarees from them and a couple of pairs of trousers and now these short ones. Um, they're a sustainable brand. They're on Instagram who don't already know about them and I'll link their website down below and um, everything is like handmade and yeah it's really nice to kind of support a sustainable brand that I can actually afford because so much sustainable brands I find aren't affordable and yeah it's it's, it's hard sometimes I feel like I know there are ones that are affordable but it's kind of hard so this is the dungaree shorts. These are the dungaree shorts. They're really cute. I kind of like doing this, like rolling up 
the shorts, like cuffing them. They're comfy, I think they'll look cute with tights and put a black polo neck underneath as well for winter. So yeah, they're really cute. There's pockets, there's even a belt loop. She can cinch it in and a pocket here as well. So, oh, and pockets at the back. Like more pockets the better. <laughs> okay, so next are these trousers from Liz Uniac and they are so cozy and comfy. I wore them the other day. I think I've worn them twice, I've had them a couple of weeks. So they've got these check trousers from Lucy Niak in loads of different colours. I think they've got them in an orange, a green and a blue, I think. And I got these in a small because they are got a stretchy waist. So yeah, I'll show you these. These are so flattering and cute. This is the waist. I put like a belt, so a belt lips here. So I put like a belt here the other day. I'm more of like a, a chunky black jumper. Um, they're super comfy, there's the pockets here. They're so cute, I love a pair of tartan trousers. I wore them with my dogs, they also look cute with trainers and you can like cuff them and roll them up. These are definitely coming on holiday with me because they're so comfy and they're not too like heavy either, like they're quite light. And I can wear them with this, I can wear them with this t-shirt, so yeah. They're really comfy and they're so, this is like a small one, they're so baggy. I would say I'm normally like a medium in things. So unless they come up oversized, then I'll go for a small. So yeah, they are really cute. I really like them. The next is this dress. It's buttons up here at the back, but I feel like I need my mum or Joe's help or something because I can't button it up and I can't be bothered. So it's like a smart casual dress. I think I would wear this like, uh, to work or on date night or something like that. It's kind of like a chill dress with tights and boots So I'll show you guys this from new look and the sleeves are kind of frilly. I got it like in the petite section It's really cute. I'll show you. Yeah, it's really cute They have a similar version to the dress like in the non petite section. They've got a similar version of the dress in like the normal size person section. It's just got bigger um, flowers on it. I could have gone for either the other one or this one, but they didn't, they didn't have that one on my size, so I went for the one in the petite section. It's really, really cute. I really like it, and it's just a cute dress. So yeah, this is the next dress from New Look. I like it because it's like a milk made and cute here. I do find that it does kind of cling to my stomach though, and I'm just a little bloated. Um, probably with tights underneath. Yeah, I don't like that it kind of clings to everything, but it is really cute. I like the print, and I feel like it's kind of full flowery as well. Okay, so this t shirt Okay, so this t-shirt is everything. Even here at the back, here, there's Jack here. I got it from the Disney store. I got it in the small. They come out quite big. Let me show you guys. So. We've got Jack here, the Pumpkin King, and I'm pairing it with this because I'm probably going to wear this outfit tomorrow because tomorrow I'm going... Tomorrow I'm going to my first pumpkin patch and I think this outfit would be really, really cute to do that with because, you know, I, Jack the Pumpkin King. He's the Pumpkin King. I love this top so much. It's really, really cute. I also have the jumper as well, which I'm tempted, but I'm broke, so... Yeah, I'm so broke, so I probably can't get the jumper. But yeah, this is really, really cute. I'm literally just saving every little bit now for Japan next week and... Yeah, this is cute. Okay, last but not least is the pair of trainers that I've been lasting over for a long time. And they are Buffalo Corin, and they're so chunky. Like, I don't know how these are the less chunky ones, how they get chunkier. They're so lovely and chunky. I was wearing these the other days and I just felt like I'm on top of the world. But then I also felt like I was gonna fall down on my face at any moment as well. So it's kind of like that in between. Um, I fit it's felt a little bit. I feel like it's because I've got like bad knees with heights. It's hard finding shoes that are kind of like supportive and um, yeah, don't irritate me. I probably just, but I really want to take them on holiday with me. So this week I'm gonna try to be really good to myself and do some like physio exercises. But yeah, these shoes are like everything. I'm gonna put them on now with this outfit. If it's not raining tomorrow, then I would wear these with 
a jack top to the pumpkin um, patch, but if not, I'm just going to wear this outfit with my Doc Martens, which will be equally as amazing. But I don't want to get these all dirty and muddy if it's raining tomorrow, so yeah. Me not being bothered to do out places is putting them aside. Oh my god, I'm getting taller, guys, literally, because... How tall am I? I'm like 5'3". My friend who's like 5'8 or something. And I put these on. And I was literally like almost getting to the same height as her. So it's really exciting. <laughs> She's like 5'7". But yeah, they give me height. I'm still not as tall as Jo in them. But didn't have to like tiptoe. So one second. Like, there we go. Okay, so these are these trainers. I really love them. They're so cool. They're amazing. Let me see if I can like zoom in. I just turned it off there instead of zooming in, but yeah, these are the trainers. I really like them. The Buffalo Corin. They're so cool. They're more comfy than the Vans. So I think my foot just swelled because it's like wearing heels and I can't really wear heels, but um, it's not as uncomfortable. So next is this really lovely sheer polka dot top from um, Bershka, I tried various actually, I've seen a bunch of these like everywhere and just a bunch of polka dots recently like they're in summer and they've moved into like um, autumn winter but in sheer things so like in Zara and various shops I've seen like it'll be like a top and then it'll be polka dots and there'll be puffy polka dot sleeves and like an uh, insert top in the middle and I really whoop, <laughs> like this version of it so um, I'm gonna insert I forgot to bring a vest top down to show you how I style it so I'm gonna insert a picture now of me wearing this shirt on date night with Joe. and yeah it's really pretty I really like it and it was from Stradivarius. Okay, that guys, with that, I'm done with this haul, finally. Um, I'm hoping to have a Halloween video based on like before Christmas out before I go on holiday. Hopefully, fingers crossed, I have enough time to, as this week is really busy. It was great to film a um, another haul for you guys, like another video in general, as it's just been like a really busy summer, but I might put some videos out that I've already filmed later. I hope you guys enjoyed this haul. I'll link what I can down below in the description and um yeah happy halloweeny season this top is just oh i love this top so much um see you guys later bye